Hello everyone, welcome to our channel Coders Lobby. Our today's topic is grouping of sheet. So today we will learn how to group the excel worksheet in workbook. Let's get started without wasting any time. So before moving to the implementation, first we should know what is the benefit of grouping of sheets. So the benefit of grouping of sheet is that all the action performed in one sheet will get performed in all the sheet at the same time at this exact location in the sheet which are in the same group now we'll see the practical implementation of grouping of sheets you can see we are in the excel here we have five sheets sheet one sheet two sheet three sheet four and sheet five so let's move to the visual basics editor here we'll see how to write the code for grouping we'll use worksheet object worksheets and inside this i will pass the array of sheet indexes which i want to combine or group I want to group sheet 2 and 5 and we'll use the select property of object worksheet select. I'm running the code, you will see sheet 5 and 2 get selected. Now you can see the sheet 2 and sheet 5 got selected. In the beginning I have told you that all the action performed in one sheet will get performed in all the other sheet in the group. So I am just uh, selecting the reason to show you the meaning of my statement. I am in sheet 2 and let's move to the sheet 5 you can see the same area got selected which are selected in sheet 2 so let's see how we can do this using VBA so for that what I have to do I will just use the worksheet object again worksheets and pass the index of sheet in which we want to show and we'll use dot range a1 dot current region dot select now i am running the code and you will see what got happened i just ran the code you can see all the area in sheet 2 and sheet 5 got selected this is all about the grouping of sheets now we will see how to ungroup the sheet to ungroup the sheet the code is very simple we will just have to use the worksheet object let first comment the above two lines and in the third line we will again use the worksheet subject worksheet and pass the index of sheet which is not in the group and we'll use the dot activate property of the sheet object worksheet object let's run the code and we'll see all the sheets are ungrouped so this is all about the grouping and ungrouping of the excel worksheets in excel workbook thanks for watching the video i hope the video is useful for you like and share the video and subscribe to our channel and don't forget to press the bell icon so that you don't miss any update whenever we post the video to our channel till the time bye bye